In recent years, the automotive industry has witnessed significant advancements in engine technology, with various impressive mini-engines making their debut. Today in this video, we'll be introducing you to the unique, promising, and innovatively designed opposed multiple-cylinder engine. The makers have claimed that this engine is the future of automotive propulsion, so to test the credibility of this claim, this video will dissect its history, design, and applications of opposed piston engines. The main question this video sets to answer is that, is it actually a game changer in the automotive industry or beyond? An opposed piston engine is a type of piston engine that features two pistons within each cylinder with no separate cylinder head. This configuration allows for a unique combustion process and offers certain advantages. Both gasoline and diesel opposed piston engines have found applications in large scale settings, such as marine vessels, military tanks, and industrial facilities. In these large scale applications, opposed piston engines are favored for their high power output, fuel efficiency, and compact design compared to traditional engines. The absence of a cylinder head simplifies the engine structure and reduces overall weight. This simplicity allows for fewer parts, potentially leading to improved reliability and ease of maintenance. Some notable manufacturers of opposed piston engines include Fairbanks Morse, Cummins, and Ecotate's Power. These companies have been at the forefront of developing and refining opposed piston engine technology for various industrial and transportation purposes. While opposed piston engines have demonstrated their advantages in specific applications, they're not as commonly used in mainstream automotive markets compared to conventional engines. However, their unique design and potential for efficiency make them a fascinating area of ongoing research and development in the field of internal combustion engines. As advancements continue, opposed piston engines may find broader applications in various industries, seeking improved performance and reduced environmental impact. By adopting this opposed piston design with interlinked swashplates, the E-Rex engine seeks to strike a balance between the advantages and drawbacks of conventional two-stroke engines. This innovative configuration opens up possibilities for improved efficiency, reduced emissions, and increased power output, making it an intriguing and potentially groundbreaking development in the realm of internal combustion engines. However, further research, testing, and analysis are required to validate its real-world performance and claims. In the innovative design of the engine e rex the conventional crankshaft and connecting rods are replaced by a unique system. Instead of connecting rods, each piston is mounted on a piston-shaped cart equipped with two wide rollers. These rollers efficiently transfer the energy generated during combustion to the cam track. Additionally, a third narrow roller is present, situated beneath a smaller diameter cam track. This roller assists in the final separation of the pistons after the combustion energy has been expelled through the exhaust ports. One of the key claims made by the company is that the forceful explosion of the exhaust gases creates a vacuum effect which facilitates the drawing of the atmospheric intake charge. As a result, the engine can achieve efficient intake and exhaust processes. Further, the engine's design allows for the possibility of supercharging, in addition to natural aspiration. The synchronization of the engine's components is achieved through the use of main cam tracks, which are connected to the common output shaft using angled gears. By manipulating moving collars that engage these gears, the timing of the left and right tracks can be adjusted. This enables alterations to the intake and exhaust timing gap by up to 12.8 degrees, consequently influencing the compression ratio. Such adaptability proves particularly advantageous when the in-engine is employed as a primary drive motor. It allows for the combination of low compression, 9.1 to 1, with super or turbocharging or higher compression at 16.7 to 1, with low or no boost operation, thereby optimizing efficiency for different applications. The in-engine E-Rex showcases its sophisticated and flexible approach to engine design, utilizing its piston carts and cam track system to create an innovative powertrain that promises enhanced performance, adaptability, and efficiency. As with any groundbreaking technology, further examination and real-world testing will be crucial to validate its potential and overall performance in practical applications. In the past, we often observed oily blue smoke emitting from various machines such as lawn boy mowers, dirt bikes, 
in Trabant. This smoke resulted from the practice of mixing lubricating oil with the intake air to provide lubrication to the crankshaft bearings, which were typical of the roller type. However, this led to undesirable smoke emissions. Over the years, significant advancements have been made to address this smoke issue. One effective solution involves segregating the lubrication of the crankshaft from the intake and exhaust systems. By doing so, the lubricating oil is no longer introduced into the intake air, reducing the occurrence of smoke. Moreover, the adoption of direct fuel injection has played a crucial role in mitigating the smoke problem. With direct fuel injection, the fuel is precisely delivered to the combustion chamber, promoting more efficient and cleaner combustion. This improvement in combustion efficiency contributes to a substantial reduction in smoke emissions. The engine under discussion incorporates both of these solutions. The crankshaft lubrication is separated from the intake and exhaust systems and it utilizes direct fuel injection. By employing these advanced techniques, the engine effectively overcomes the traditional issue associated with smoky exhaust emissions, ensuring a cleaner and more environmentally friendly operation. In contrast to orbital two-strokes and other engines that employ conventional poppet valves, the engines we're discussing continues to utilize cylinder ports located near the bottom of each piston stroke. This design characteristic possesses a challenge in terms of the limited time available for the exhaust gases from the previous combustion cycle to exit the cylinder and for a fresh intake charge to enter. To address this issue, the engine often incorporates turbocharging or supercharging. The inclusion of forced induction, such as turbo or supercharging, helps improve the overall performance of the engine by increasing the intake air pressure. This, in turn, allows for a more efficient scavenging process, helping to evacuate the exhausted gases quickly and facilitating the entry of fresh intake charges. However, even in cases where forced induction is not employed, it becomes challenging to prevent oxygen from exiting the cylinder along with the exhaust gases. As a result, the traditional three-way catalytic converter, commonly used in gasoline engines to reduce emissions, may become less effective due to the presence of oxygen in the exhaust stream. It is worth noting that the design choices in this engine, such as the utilization of cylinder ports and the potential use of forced induction, impact its overall performance, efficiency, and emission characteristics. In certain applications, these features may be advantageous, but they also require careful engineering to ensure optimal engine operation and compliance with emission regulations. As with any engine design, trade-offs and considerations must be made to strike the right balance between performance and environmental impact. Lean NOx absorber catalysts, commonly used in diesel engines, present certain challenges, such as high cost sensitivity to operating conditions, and the need for periodic regeneration using a separate fluid. To address these issues, some propose operating engines on hydrogen, a fuel that does not produce hydrocarbons during combustion. Additionally, opposed piston engines offer the advantage of a cooler combustion chamber, resulting in significantly lower NOx emissions. However, a potential concern arises when considering the lubrication of piston rings in an opposed piston engine. Traditional lubricants used in engines are hydrocarbon-based oils, and even when running on hydrogen, trace amounts of hydrocarbon-based CO2 and other emissions may be produced due to lubrication requirements. The development of effective and efficient lubrication methods that do not rely on hydrocarbon-based oil is crucial to minimize emissions when operating on hydrogen. Finding alternative lubrication solutions could help achieve the goal of significantly reducing hydrocarbon emissions when using this clean fuel source in opposed piston engines. The automotive industry is continually exploring various technologies and approaches to achieve cleaner and more sustainable transportation solutions. As advancements are made in lubrication technology and engine design, the potential for hydrogen-powered post-piston engines to reduce emissions further and improve overall environmental performance becomes more feasible. However, ongoing research and development efforts are necessary to address these challenges and realize the full potential of such engines in reducing harmful emissions. The in-engine E-Rex boasts several compelling features that set it apart as an innovative internal combustion engine. 1. Super smooth operation. 
The E-Rex engine achieves exceptional smoothness due to perfectly balanced reciprocating masses and combustion forces acting equally in both directions. This balanced design minimizes vibrations as demonstrated by a coin balancing on the end of the engine, as shown on the website. Two, high thermal efficiency. The E-Rex's unique opposed piston configuration ensures efficient utilization of heat energy. Since combustion presses equally on both pistons, most of the heat gets transferred to the pistons themselves, reducing the superheating of the cylinder head, which would otherwise necessitate excessive cooling. Three, symmetrical power takeoff. Gearing the two cam tracks together eliminates the need for complex pushrod mechanisms or multiple crankshafts. This simplification streamlines the power transfer process and also offers the advantage of a symmetrical power takeoff. In longitudinal placements, this design enables a 50-50 power split, making it feasible to provide all-wheel drive AWD at the cost of employing two transmissions. 4. Multi-Fuel Adaptability The E-Rex engine's variable compression ratio design makes it highly versatile and adaptable to various fuel types. This flexibility ensures compatibility with different fuels, enhancing its sustainability for diverse applications. 5. Elimination of Valves and Deposits the engine's design eliminates the need for traditional poppet valves, which can accumulate harmful deposits over time. By avoiding port injection, the E-Rex mitigates the valve deposit issue, resulting in improved long-term reliability and reduced maintenance concerns. 6. Impressive Specific Power The E-Rex engine showcases exceptional specific power due to its streamlined design. By eliminating the need for separate valve trains and cylinder heads and employing a straightforward connection between the cam plates, including the variable compression regulator, the engine achieves an impressive power-to-weight ratio. The in-engine E-Rex's amalgamation of these features positions it as an intriguing and promising contender in the realm of internal combustion engines. Its potential for enhanced efficiency, power density, and adaptability to various fuels makes it an exciting prospect for future automotive applications. As with any innovative technology, real-world testing and validation will be crucial to fully comprehend the engine's capabilities and assess its practical advantages in different scenarios. If you enjoyed this incredible journey with us, like this video and subscribe to our channel. Remember to click the bell icon to get updates about our latest content too. Thanks for watching.